Hey guys, how's it going? Shares back again. Welcome to episode number 105, I think this is now, of the Football Manager Stream series. Feel free to uh, skip forward a few minutes if you're watching on uh, YouTube, because obviously the opening few moments is spent by me just setting up the stream and getting set up, etc. The little notification video is on its way to sub boxes right now, but YouTube has been a bit of a bitch over the past uh, 24 hours or so, so how many people will see that video, I'm not entirely sure. However... We will stream anyway, despite the fact there are two Champions League games on right now and an FA Cup game, I still felt like streaming. I wasn't going to not stream because of other games, because there are people out there that would still like to watch. I'm gonna, I've am going got a back scratcher, like a telescopic back scratcher, and it is like an absolute godsend. It's the best thing in the world ever, I swear. So good. Hey, so good. Hey, guys. Is Nightbot in? I'll have to check in a sec. Back scratcher, back scratcher. I think I need to move the uh, need to move the camera along a bit, don't I? Because I keep like, disappearing out the left. So if you come here, oh look, there we go. Actually, I might, I could probably just do this, couldn't I? There we go. That was it. That was better. The thing, actually, if I do that now, is it still? A, oh no, it's still a green screen. Okay, fair enough. Okay, fair enough. I just needed to check. Alright, I'll tweet the stream out and then we will jump in. Um Why are you popping up now? Go away, you stupid piece of software. Logitech just popped up. Did Carol just miss a, a guilt edge chance? I've got I've got the West Ham game on above me. I, I've been flicking between all three games that are on right now, all evening. And I keep missing goals. Like I'll flick, flick to the Barca game, and a goal went in, in in the buying game. Vidal scored. Flick back to the buying game, and then a goal went in for Man United. And I was just like, oh. There's only, there's only two minutes left. Only two minutes left of the Man United game. Unless, of course, West Ham score, in which case there'll be more than two minutes left, because it will go to extra time. And it might still drop for Kiate. No, De Gea saved it. No, that is the chance. That was the chance. Andy Carroll De Gea saved again. Cuyate offside. He's offside. Oh my god. Scenes at West Ham. David De Gea is just too good. De Gea is just ridiculous. Still 2-1 though. They've still not taken the free kick. They've shown like five replays. I'm making a substitution as well. Right, let's jump in, shall we? I do like watching the football with you guys though. Like seeing the chat go nuts when there's a goal in real life and stuff. Right, so it's currently the 6th of January. We've got Exeter in the FA Cup now to start us off right at the very beginning of the stream. And then we'll get back into the transfers. Hey! 
we got as far as literally the screen selection yesterday so we will finish everything off uh, here today actually let's put Andre Wisdom at right back, we'll put Callum Chambers at centre back, we'll put Flanagan at left back uh, Squirtle, Flanagan um, but Tweedy's injury is going to frustrate me here Never mind. I don't want to call. I don't want to call Groich back. So, Ruben Legendhood just subscribed for twelve months in a row. Thank you very much, my man. The fourth or fifth uh, full year's worth of subscription to the channel. Thank you very much, bro. I really appreciate that. You guys have been showing the support for a long time now here on Twitch, and. I can't even begin to tell you how much I appreciate it. Pai has got a free kick. If ever he needed to pop up with a free kick of love, now is it. Pai A, deflected corner. I think it was on target. Um, oh, I could put Studge on the right, maybe. Put Ive on the right. Firmino at Cam. Origi on the left and Sturridge up top. Ah, Origi's, Origi's stamina though. Uh, when's the next game after this? Is it a full week? No, oh, see, it's on Wednesday. Although it is against West Brom. No, I'll play Origi. Play Origi. Might as well. Sacco. Control. Walker. Pastore, Yami, and um, Inglings. I completely forgot, to be honest, Cam. Plus, we're in the middle of the transfer window right now, so people are... I'm sure people would much much rather watch me play the transfer window than play, you on, play people on FIFA. Josh Lauren. He's playing well for him. Right, well, we'll see. I'm just going to calmly say uh, play a natural game will win. Listened nervously. Right, Flanagan. To be fair, Flanagan, five games, three assists. That's pretty decent. That's pretty decent, that. Yeah, maybe we'll just do, uh, like, subscribe a weekend rather than Sunday. Like, just we'll just do Saturday. Saturday and Sunday. Well, there's a good start. 1-0 after a minute and a half. What I'll do, I'll probably tweet out. I'll tweet out, like, Friday. I'll tweet out Friday afternoon or Saturday afternoon and ask what you guys want me to do. Or what you want me to play. Make sure you follow me on Twitter. Oh, Rigi, you got to bury that. Tawny. I think you might want to readdress your spelling of tournament, baby. Tawny meant. Final whistle, United are through. Uh, right, let's put the Champions League back on then, shall we? 4 1 4. Atleti. I want Atleti to go through. This is good football. Fine again. Hendo. Should have squared it. Uh, 
Could do a tournament on FM at the weekend. But only if people were available for both Saturday and Sunday. Otherwise, it would be pointless. Like, if people got through to, like, the latter stages of the tournament and then couldn't play on the Sunday. It'd be kind of shit. Plus, people's internet connections aren't normally the best either. It's it's like it's it's really hard to to do subscriber like games with subscribers when you guys are like dotted so far around the world. Like, oh, finished by the way, but from Firmino, that's two 0 But I shall persevere with it because you guys support me, so it's only fair that I play with you as well at times. just difficult to because I only stream for two hours at, at a time like if streaming was my only income I, if I didn't do YouTube then I could do like a six hour stream and it wouldn't matter but I can't I can't I don't have six hours spare so uh, I'm just gonna say I'm pleased with how things are going I might take a review off hey everyone we got Le Damnation. It is a £10 donation from... Ah! Did you say your name was Steve? My brain is telling me Steve. Sentinel Shark, £10. Says, hey, Chez, just thought I... Uh, bleh, just thought I'd drop by... Uh, I can't read, apparently. Hey, Chez, just thought I'd quick drop by and donate. Sorry that it isn't, isn't much. It's £10, bro. Anyway, I know you might not need another centre-back, but can you look at Jesus Fiejo? Keep up the good work, or Vallejo. I will do. Thank you very much for the donation, bro. Am I... You did ask me to... I swear it was Steve. You'll have to let me know in the chat whether I've remembered that correctly or incorrectly. Sturridge should make it three and has. But thank you very much for the donation. And it is a sizable donation as well. You definitely don't have to worry about it not, not being much. Good finish from Studge. Squeezing it in the near post after taking it round the keeps. Uh, we've got about 60 million at the minute, Panda Cam. About 60 million. So we did have... We did have about... Oh, Exit have scored one. We did have about two. Then we sold, like, claimed a few uh, incoming transfer clauses early, and that gave us 20-odd. Then the board offered us the opportunity to up our season expectations. That gave us another 20, and we ended up selling Alberto Moreno, kind of against my will, but he wanted out, and we ended up selling Alberto Moreno to um, PSG, I think. We've got a penalty. Sold Alberto Moreno to PSG for another 20-odd. So we, we've got about 60 million. Uh, no, there's a... Pardon me. There's going to be a teaser of the AC Milan Carimo going up tomorrow. But the first episode proper will go up on Friday. Studge Bear, is it? Is that a hat-trick for Sturridge? Yeah, it is. So yeah, there'll be a teaser tomorrow, and then uh, the first episode proper will go up on Friday. Oh, Barca keep coming closer and closer to scoring, and Atleti just keep living on the on the edge. We've got a four-one win away from home against Exeter. I'm pleased with that. Good win, boys. Well done. Didn't really expect anything else than an easy win there. The board do want us to go quite far in all cup competitions. So it's nice to get through. Whoa! Whoa! Cambridge United beat Swansea. Yes, boys! Cambridge 2, Swansea 1. 84th minute, David Ball. Go on, the boys. How's that for an upset? Uh. Uh, 
Uh, just taking it one game at a time. Ojo, mm, an okay game, but nothing spectacular. Is he still growing, though? He is still growing, but not necessarily at the speed that I need him to for next season. Way angry at losing to Wood. I'm not doing any mind games. I was just answering questions in the press, my man. Answering questions in the press. Nothing more. Uh, we don't need any forward players, Mr. Primetime, so I don't need Dennis Suarez. Is he transfer listed? Have a look. Transfer status listed. Dennis Suarez. Yeah, he's transfer listed. I, I really don't need anyone in those positions, though, bro. Sorry. Oh, Grantman. A great chance for I'm desperate for Atleti to win. Yeah, he was really salty, e gamer. He was very salty. Fourth round draw is coming up in a day's time, so we'll see who we get in the next position. Next position, in the next round. I always do that. I'll be saying something and I'll read the chat, and what I'm reading in the chat will come out of my mouth rather than what I actually wanted to say. Uh, yeah, Doria. He's all right, but he's nowhere near as good as uh, Masaccio, who we're bringing in. Round trip tempted by Liverpool. Uh, Ross Barclay. Come on, you want to loan him? Yeah, you can loan him. Uh, not for rotation, though. Suit sells. Yeah, I answered that already, Cam. I answered that question already. Just waiting on finalising the deal for Jorge, the Brazilian left back, young Brazilian left back. And oh no, the Cambridge sold one of their top goal scorers. What? Oh no, he only had five. I thought he had more than that. They better use that money well. You better reinvest that because he was your he was your second highest goal scorer. Oh, Real Madrid's Hall. If Hall, I bet he ends up going to Real Madrid over us. I'll be pissed. Hey, we go. Masaccio set to join. Thank you very much. Hello, welcome to the club. Hi. Oh, yes, Viejo. Thank you very much for reminding me. Oh, you forgot, Ed. As is. Always the way with me. He is playing... He's in the first team squad for Real, but he's not necessarily playing every week. Ah, no, shit. Browse. Stop. Stop. I want to send him on an intensive language course. Oh, good. There we go. Actually, we'll register him in the squad as well. Uh, where are you, mate? Oh, hello. Tell him a Estoril. He's not for sale. He's not for sale. You can have him on loan, but he's not for sale. Huh, okay, I offered him on loan instead, and they're like, okay. Hani Mukta, what? Who's he? I'll scout him, but we don't need anyone in that position. Mustachio! Right, fourth round draw of the FA Cup. Give me Cambridge, please. We were Cambridge with the very next name after the very next club out out of the hat when we uh, were in the other draw. We got Exeter. I'm desperate to play Cambridge. Cambridge, 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 Cambridge. Ugh, Peterborough, cunts. You reckon I'll get West Ham? Well, West Ham are already out the hat, I'm afraid, so I can't get West Ham. <laughs> Who are we going to get? Who we... I'll take Wrexham away. No, they got Leicester. They got one L Premier League side, but it wasn't me. 
Leicester. <gasps> please, please, please. No, Cambridge Reading. Uh, no, we were the next name out the hat again. Are you mad? Because I am. We missed, we missed out on playing Cambridge by one ball out of the hat last time, and we've done it again. Fuck. I play Leeds instead. Leeds, 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 Leeds. Fuck my life. Screw you, football manager. Bayejo. Bayejo. Doesn't reckon he's any good, really. Uh, this guy is average. Yeah. Uh, 129 million pounds spent by Liverpool on transfer fees this season is a new record. New record transfer, Matteo Masaccio. Although to be fair, we only paid 16 up front. I'm pleased with that. Squirtle's going to go to Ipswich. Bye! Bye, Squirtle! And Wisdom is going to Wolfsburg. That deal is done as well. Uh, one of the lowest average net transfer outlays. You're performing remarkably this season. Yeah. Lowest net transfer outlays, despite having spent £130 million. Pounds. Bradford got 750 grand, so Andrew Wisdom is gone. Uh, delighted. Don't want to answer that. Deal we're very happy with. Best players possible. Uh, no risk of that. Certainly asking Javier to help. No problem. Uh, not discussing my team sheet. Yes, Mateo can lead this club to glory. Something the club needs to press on with. Fantastic progress we're making as a club. That one. There we go. I'm not going to throw him straight into the starting lineup because our current defensive unit has been incredible. Uh, okay. One point five million for Tobia. My director of football is added again. Sure, whatever. Uh, yeah, I really don't mind. Sure, if you reckon he's good, then we'll sign him. Get demoted, then you can play Cambridge. <laughs> yeah, shall I just take it? I'll just take a random League Two job. Leave Liverpool and go to League Two. made for Zivkovic, Porto and Juventus. Doesn't feel like taking a wage cut would be in his best interests. Ooh, what about signing for me? What about signing for me? I might go in for... I'm tempted to go in for Diego. Matip. Sacco. Coentrell. Chaka. Jordan Henderson. No, not Origi. Lacazette. Astori. Uh, Yami. And, well, Danny Ings, to be honest. Although, to be fair, Sturridge just scored a hat-trick. But, to be fair, Danny Ings scored a hat-trick the game before that, so... Oh, I don't even know what to do. Masashi on the bench, though. IB... IB! Firmino. <coughs> uh, Studge and Origi, I think. Yeah. Yeah! Yeah! 
Uh, I will be vlogging the Cambridge game, yes, Josh, next week. Auto number number four. Decent. There you go. We are favourites against bottom of the league. I'm just going to assertively say, go out and put on the worthy display. We'll see how we get on. On the back of a good win against Exeter. What a great pass there from Jordan Henderson. Well done. That was incredible. It was incredible. Hate it when everyone's on form, yeah. I don't know Blast of Benfica, to be honest. I don't know whether it's Masaccio or Masaccio. I'll have to have a. I'll check on my pronunciation website and see if it's on there. Some players' names are on there and some aren't. Let's have a look. Oh, good save. Oh, here we go. Hang on. We turn the sounds off there. Matteo Musacchio. Musacchio. Matteo Musacchio. Musacchio. It's a, yeah, it's a hard C. Matteo Musacchio. Matteo Musacchio. Okay, now I know how to pronounce that. Thank you very much, Forvo.com. Matteo Musacchio. I've always called him Musacchio, to be honest. But it is Musacchio. What was the best game I watched at Cambridge? Uh, best game ever at Cambridge was probably... Playoff semi-final against Stevenage in 2009. Yeah, in the 2008-2009 season. Playoff, playoff semi-final second leg against Stevenage. Won it, won it in the 119th minute of extra time to go to Wembley. Unfortunately, we lost at Wembley, but yeah. Bum 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 ba ba da 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 ba. Uh, Cambridge, you've got Morecambe on Tuesday. We've got Carlisle at the, on Saturday, and then Morecambe on uh, Tuesday. Can we create an opportunity, please, lads? Thanks. Ref? All right. Oh, that is a ball and a half. I swear on Doné scored against us last time we played West Brom. Yannick Ferrer Carrasco has just come off for Thomas. For Atleti, so they're going defensive. They're taking off a winger for a holding mid. Um, yeah, I'm disappointed with that first half. Show me something else, lids. Yeah, we beat Exit at 4 1, Andrew. Four girls to one. Sturridge scored a hat trick. Barca score is 1 0 to Atleti. So it's 2 2 on aggregate, which means Atleti currently go through on away goals. Guys. Would you mind awfully scoring a goal? <sighs> I 
I really don't want to draw or lose to West Brom. I know we're away from home, but still. Okay. Tackle him! Or intercept. Oh, never mind. I might bring Studge on in a minute. I think Bayern will win the Champions League again. This year. Personally. We haven't had a single shot so far this half. And if they keep playing balls in behind like that, we will soon end up going behind. Kicking off. Ryan Fran is lying on the floor rolling around when he didn't really get hurt at all. Boys, can we... Come on. Thank you, Sturridge. Yes, Daniel. That's exactly what we needed. And it was Cohen Trail that set it up as well. Uh, slow mode is still on from last night, Michael. Uh oh. Tried to make a change when something's happening on pitch. In before West Brom goal. I knew we should have cancelled the substitution. Every time it happens, though, it just goes further and further to prove my point. You make tactical changes whilst there's a highlight on, you'll concede, or at least there'll be a clear cut goal scoring opportunity, but. 80% of the time, you'll concede a goal. Give me a 1 1 draw against West Brom. Not good enough. They're bottom of the league, West Brom. That was a chance to go second. Not good enough, lads. Yeah, we could have gone second with that, and that was our game in hand as well. Fuck. Oh well. We're still only a point off second, so I guess that's all that matters. Benfica scored. Hey, everyone. We just got a donation. It's a pound from Blobby Robbie. It says, Hi, Chez, do my GCSEs and you, Cricket and Alton Towers, the only things dragging me through it. The name is Rob, by the way. Yeah, I will try and remember to call you Rob rather than Robbie. Thank you very much for the donation. Best of luck with your GCSEs, bro. I can't believe we didn't beat West Brom there. That's frustrating, that. Really frustrating. Everybody, no interest in joining. Knew that would happen. We offered him 
We offered him £97,000 a week. And he would have been pushing first team. And he's gone to Real for £47,000 a week. That's the wrong move, in my opinion, for him. That's the wrong move. Oh, that's pissed me off. Liverpool step up chase for Wilshire? I don't think so. Really going to offer me Rico Henry. Thanks for that, mate. I might go back in for Miguel Layoun, but we can do better than that, I'm sure. We'll play Stoke. We'll play Stoke, and then we'll have a real look at left-backs again. Oh, God. I really wanted that Jorge guy. Fuck my life! Yeah, only reason to sit on the bench at Real is the money, but I offered him twice as much. I offered him £97,000 a week, and he turned me down. Oh, it looks like Zivkovic is going to Porto. Negotiation, you want 19.25. I'll give you 16. First team, you can have him. Sometimes people accept that. Um, First team thing, and sometimes people don't. Gadeen. Oh, I could offer him the captaincy. I'd rather just offer him a deal, because if I talk to him, he'll say no. He's on 100k a week, where he is now. So I'll offer him 115. He wants 150. Maybe 120. Been a good deal it down. Stoke are a tough side to play as well. I'm not looking forward to this. Gonna have to play uh, a bit of a rotation side as well. Give Masaccio his first game. Welcome to England, Matteo. Stoke came off the bench to get the winning goal in the last game, so I can only I can only start him. Really, will be harsh to not to. Harsh to not to. Danny Ings. Origi. Avenge what happened last time, yeah. We got so we thought this would happen though, didn't we? We'd have a a wobble result wise. Not that we've had a wobble really, we've just drawn against West Brom, but we thought we'd have a bit of a wobble because of the 
sheer number of fixtures we've got in this month. But one nil up. One nil up after four minutes. Come on, Atleti. Hold on for five more minutes. Uh, West Ham finished 2-1 to Man United, Curtis. Clear that. No! What a header, by the way, from Ryan Shawcross. Oh, my God. Atleti are on the break. Please. Oh, Felipe Luis. Felipe Luis. Handball! Has got... How have you not seen that? He's given a pen. He's given a pen. Pen to, pen to Atleti. Iniesta looks so, so sheepish lying there on the floor. Diego Simeone is crying for a red card. Penalty to Atleti. What a run from Felipe Luis. That's, it's, a, it's got to be a red card. To be fair, he can't not send Iniesta off there, and he hasn't sent him. Did he even book him? Did he even book Iniesta there? Who's taking it? Griezmann. Yes! Lacazette, we're in front again. Come on, Antoine. Bury it in the bottom corner. Oh, Christ! Testega nearly got to it, but Antoine's buried it. Atletia through to the next round, boys. Yes! Fuck off, Barca. Atleti! Atleti! Oh, Alexander Lacazette, ladies and gentlemen. Hat trick. What a finish. What a finish from Lacazette that was. How's he how's he got that across the keeper from there into the far top corner? Oh. Man the match Griezmann on the ultimate team, yeah. What part, Letty? No, my TV's not delayed, Michael. <laughs> the stream is delayed. You see me 15 to 20 seconds after I say anything. Why do I not like Barca? Um, I'm a Chelsea fan. <laughs> I think you can probably work that one out for yourself. Go on. Oh, we well, still might. Firmino! 4 1. Yeah. Right, let's switch to standard. Take off, look for the overlap. Dribble less. Be more disciplined. Yes, boys. I can't believe he didn't even book Iniesta for that. Like that's just ridiculous. They've just bought an Angel career as well. Career, sorry. And he's has he immediately got himself booked? No, sixteen's Koke, isn't it? No, Koke's six. 
Kamu nak? A 4-1 win at home against Stoke. That's very pleasing. Especially after the damp squib that was the game against West Brom. And that has moved us up into second. Although Arsenal can go above us again should they win their game in hand. West Ham 6, Watford 1, by the way. Uh, yeah, no, Bayern are, Bayern are leading on aggregate, aren't they? Unless Benfica has scored again. Yeah, Bayern are going through 3-2 on aggregate, Curtis. It's, away goals haven't even come into it, but... Benfica need to score twice, because if they score once, then Bayern will go through on away goals. But Lewandowski's clean through. Oh, he's kicked it straight at the keeper. Idiot. Game is lost, for fuck's sake. What's happened? What's happened in the... Oh, we've seen a replay. Oh, they're crying for handball. Mm, that's probably a pen to, probably a pen to, um, probably should be a pen to Barca. Oh, it's a free kick, he's given it outside the box. That's what they were complaining about. He's given it outside the box. That was inside the box. Should have been a pen. I think because the ref's seen his feet. The ref's seen his feet outside the box. He thinks the hands are like his his feet are like his feet are there. The referee thinks he's stood up straight, but he's not. He's leant back like that when it's hit his arm. I think that's what's caught the referee. Messi missed the free kick anyway. Mazakia makes Liverpool debut, got a 7.1. Alexandre Lacazette gets another hat trick. He's the top goal scorer this year. Look at Ings, by the way. 14 goals in 10 starts. It's ridiculous. Right, I'm going to quit. I'm desperate for the toilet, but I'm trying to hang on until the um, the game's finished. They've just put on Stefan Savage for Fernandez. Right, so we might be getting Diego Godin as well, which is slightly overkill, but if you have the opportunity to sign someone like that, why why wouldn't you... Pardon me. Koke's taking it to the corner. I don't. It doesn't. It doesn't say in the graphic in the top left how much time's left. How much they've added on. I like Atleti, man. Right, we are gonna we really do need to look at left back now though. Oh, it's plus five, is it? I crossed my legs. We can get Godin in.
Because if Barca score, it goes to extra time. Juventus have withdrawn their bid for Zivkovic. Strange. Oh, he's going to go to Porto, isn't he? That's why. I'm gripped. I'm, I'm sorry, I'm gripped by this Barca Atleti game. There's uh, literally seconds remaining, but Arda Turan is trying to beat uh, Gria, uh, Felipe Luis, who's just determined. Goal kick, game over. Felipe Luis, man. He's so good for Atleti. He was, he was good for Chelsea, but he's just outstanding for Atleti. Referee's still not blowing his whistle. They're in. They're about to go into the seventh of five minutes added on. The referee still hasn't blown his whistle. Now he has. There you go. Atleti are through. Yeah. 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 Atleti. Transfers. Of football suggest signing suggest transfer targets defender left suggest alright director of football recommends me Leon Grimaldo or Willems tell you what Grimaldo Grimaldo looks good And Layoun we know about. Layoun's already on my shortlist, isn't he? Uh, Alibor will remove. Oh, I'm gutted about Jorge. De Vrij, Bayerin, Bartra, Jimenez. Mm. I'll take Mendy out. No, I'll leave Mendy there just in case. Shah, Mamana, Stuart Long I'll remove as well. Atleti are through. Grimaldo. It's going to be Willems. It's going to be Jetto. Has he got a has he got a minimum release fee clause? Don't think he does. But we will offer twenty five for him. He wants thirty three. I tell you what, I'll give you ten now, and I'll give you another. 17 and a half. Oh. They're determined to get that 33, aren't they? I think we'll go for Jetro Willems. Oh, 160 grand a week. He's on. How's this for greed? He's on £20,000 a week at Sporting and he's asking me for 160. I will give you a substantial wage, but you're not having 160. Cool, oh, deary me. Deary me! I don't know how Sporting got him on such low wages, to be honest. That's a fails a recommendation, of course he does.
We're about to sign Diego Godin. Amrabat has gone to Marseille from Chelsea. <gasps> Godin, Godin! Diego Godin signs. Send on intensive language course. Actually, squad registration as well. Godin, Godin! Now we've got four world-class centre-backs. Nah. Four top-class centre-backs, not world-class. Diego Godin is world-class. But Sacco and Matip and Masakio aren't world-class, but they are top-class. Yeah. Brozovic has gone to Lazio. Fucking shit house. Uh, sure. Sure. No. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Okay. Right, bear with me. I will go for that piss. <laughs> Two six. BRB. Hello. Go Dean, go Dean. Pardon me. Hey everyone. All right, who we got this weekend? Why are you telling me about that? It's Mustache Man, that's why. It knew. It knew that I would want it to know about Mustache Man. Mario is going to AC Milan from Chills. Mario. It's me, Mario. Zivikovic is going to Porto. See ya. Bye. Lorendo Infini. I don't need any players in those positions. I just don't. When is the transfer window over? Uh, after the month of January, my man. Daniel Weiss is going to Juve. He 
It's just like if you ever needed a squad player. Chelsea signed Fellaini. Brilliant. Real Madrid in bid for Matip. Uh, no. You can't have him. Jetro Willems is a Liverpool player. Yeah. Ready? Send on intensive language course. Matip wants new contracts. I thought, I thought as much. Was that wants new contract or wants to discuss future? Uh, continental football. Yeah. My team will stay. If we can't qualify for Europe, my team will leave, but that's fine. We said the same for Andre Wisdom, but we sold him anyway. <laughs> Time to play Middlesbrough. There you go, you can extend his loan. Tebo, Tebo, Horn. Oh, do we throw Jetro Willem straight in the deep end? No. No! I won't. I'm not going to do that. Uh, oh, Firmino, or Firmino, 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 Firmino's actually pushing to be, like, first team cam again. John Flanagan, Flanagan, Flanagan. Tetro. Jordan I, Pastore, and Danny Ings. Contrail doesn't have to start every game, but he's um, he's more familiar with our setup. So come on, the boys, Middlesbrough away. Let's go. Kane only scores penalties. Are you a mentalist? Kane scores, scores fantastic goals. Oh, great. Okay, cool. Penalty to Middlesbrough after seven minutes. I don't know, Rob, to be honest. I'll have to check and see how Coutinho and um, like Emery Shannon that are getting on at Real Madrid. It's not exactly the start we were after, to be honest. Hashtag blame Brozovic. Can we do something? That's... Thanks. Oh, how's that for a ball? Find a teammate, and he has done. Yami's in, Yami scores. That is phenomenal. To bring that down with a defender on his shoulder and still bury it near post as hard as possible. Bring that down. Got defender in front of him, one on his shoulder, and he smashed it. One one. Now let's build and get ourselves in front.
The good thing about being bringing in players like Godin and Masakio in this window means that if we qualify for Champions League or Europa League football next year, we already have people at the club that will be able to, you know, that are familiar with the club for right at the very beginning of the season. We don't have to go out in the summer transfer window and buy players to help us compete in the Champions League and then have them have to go through a settling in period. Because we're having a good season presently, we've been able to bring in the, the quality of player early so they can settle in and we should be ready to go straight from the off next year if we qualify for Europe. I don't want to jinx myself. Sturridge has a bruised head. All right, we'll take you off. Come on, Danny, on you go. Yeah, go on then, Danny is. Come on, Danny. Turn it around for us. You're right, Alfie. We have really turned Liverpool around. I'm delighted, to be honest. I'm really pleased with how well this, this Liverpool team is playing right now. Considering the state of the club when we first joined, um, I couldn't, you couldn't be happier with how things are going right now. I could be. We could be 2-1 up against... Although Tottenham's just gone 2-1 down against Norwich. We could win against Middlesbrough, though. No, Marco Royce equalises a minute later. Brilliant. Thought Tottenham were going to drop points and then Marco Royce equalises. Don't concede now, though. That would really piss me off. One all draw against Middlesbrough. We are third. All we need to do now is just build a gap to the side in fifth, but Man United have a game in hand and can come up to 44 should they win that. Who is their game in hand against? Everton, presumably, because they're the only other side on 22. Although we have Everton midweek next in the Capital One Cup. Fortunately, we have a decent lead in that tie. We have a decent lead in this Capital One Cup tie. 4-1 from the first leg, so... We should be able to play quite well and get through to the final. Recommended me, recommended me, kind of it. Right, yeah, let's have a look and see how. Uh, how's Ballo getting on at Munchen Gladbach? I tell you what, he's not doing bad. Thirty, you can't quite see down the bottom, can you? Because of the overlay. No. In all, in all competitions this year, Balotelli has thirteen goals in twenty-one games. Eight in sixteen in the Bundesliga. Five in five in Europe. So. Ballo's doing well. Um, how is Coutinho doing at Bayern? Coutinho has five goals, three assists in 13 games in the Bundesliga. Seven goals, four assists in 19 overall. So he's having a decent decent time of things at Bayern. And Emre Chan at Real Madrid is playing a very heavily, very heavy rotation role. 16 starts, 11 appearance, 11 substitute appearances, 4 goals, 4 assists. Which is decent. But he's a fringe... Pardon me, he's a fringe player. Lalana at Stoke. Uh, yeah, average. Hasn't played in Europe, obviously, and hasn't played in the Cup either. So 10 appearances, no assists, no goals. Uh, Giuliano at Celta has four goals, two assists, or six goals, five assists in 29 starts in all comps. Uh, and Joe Allen was the other one we sold, wasn't it? And Joe Allen has gotten 
one assist in 19 games for Fulham. Who will win the Champions League? I think Bayern, probably. I think Bayern will win it. Personally, Adam Phillips can have his loan move ex extended. Favourite chain restaurant? Probably Byron Burger. Laundry Green. Frank Sacco wants to leave to talk to Real Madrid. Well, we've managed to convince Sacco and Matip to stay and help us qualify for Champions League here. Flanagan bid. No, reject. Napoli make Mignolet bid. Real Madrid are in for Matip again. They're offering me a lot of money, but he's not going anywhere. Mignolet bid. Reject. Alright, Everton in the Capital One cut off. Forgot to. New entire team selection. Mignolet. Uh, we'll play Flanagan at right back. Oh, unfortunately, Matip and Masakio can't play. Cup tied for the next match having... Ah, oh, yeah, because it's the second leg, so they haven't signed in time for this round. That makes sense. Well, we'll play Sacco and Callum Chambers then. And Cohen Trail. Actually, no. Flanagan at left back, Callum Chambers at right back. And... Matip in the middle. Uh, Pastore there. Henderson. Let's play Jordan Ibe. Firmino. Origi. And Ings. So we are 4-1 up after the first leg, so... We don't need to take too many risks. Yami. Back is it. And I think that's everyone I can select, actually. Yeah, everyone else is either cut, tied, or injured. Oh. Danny Mad Ting Zings. You're not wrong. Assertively, fans, fans, fans. We'll do something for the fans. Oh, I've got them put on a worthy display, we'll say that. Um, Alright, that's not necessarily the start we wanted. 1 0 down after 50 seconds. I don't, Klopp's manager of the German national side, Lloyd, in this save now, or at least he was. Oh, 
Oh, lovely ball, Danny. Firmino, surely. Oh, even on the second attempt. Origi. Oh, my God. How have we not scored? There's like four chances there. Post, keeper, keeper, block. That was ridiculous. I don't know how we've not scored there. That was one of the most ridiculous passages of play I think I've ever seen. Firmino's looking exhausted. Come on, Firmino. Don't do this to me now. Oh, no, we'll put Pastore at camp. Oh, Barkley hits the post. Yeah, all three clear-cut opportunities. We missed them all. Man United 1-2-1, one, one, Anthony. Beep, beep. Um, keep your performance levels up. Come on, the boys. Uh, who scored? Uh, Rashford. Rashford. Radford. Is it Rashford? No, it's Rashford. Rashford scored a cracker. And uh, Fellaini scored as well for Man United. And James Tomkins scored for West Ham. Oh my god, how's Minile saved that? Come on, you got a challenge for that. No, Salomon. We're pushing our luck here. We are pushing our luck. Got a donation, I'll check that in a second. I just want to see if Chaka can bury this in the top corner. Yes, 5 2. I think we're going to the Capital One Cup final, boys. It's a whoa, it's a 35 pound donation from Makara One. Says, Hi, says, just wanted to donate something to say thanks, really. Your videos and streams have made the difference for me of late, to be honest. So, yeah, uh, thanks, dude. Keep up the good work. Well, I'm glad to, uh, to hear that, bro. Thank you very much for that donation. That's a big one. That actually will put you on the all-time highest donator individual donation list on my uh, channel page. In fact, that will put you quite high on that list, too. Uh, oh, pause that. Oh, we scored again. Danny Ings. Uh, that puts you fifth on the top single donators list. Thank you very much, bro. That's very kind of you to drop a £35 donation. Makara won. Let's have a look. Uh, I'll alter it. Makara won. Make sure I spelled that right. Yep, Makara won. £35. Cheers, bro. It's very kind of you. I'm glad my content has uh, helped you in some way, pal. Danny Ings. Mad Tings Danny Ings. Well, Danny, Danny Mad Tings Ings. So, such a tongue twister. Danny Mad Tings Ings. Yeah, there you go. You are now one, two, three, four, five, sixth. Uh, that hasn't updated. Did I not click save? Am I an idiot? We've scored again, Chaka. What is going on? 7 2 on aggregate. I did save it. 
That's weird. You know, when I did that, it didn't... Maybe I need to refresh. Let's refresh. Uh, there we go. One, two, three, four. Yeah, you're sixth on the all-time single donators list. So thank you very much, Makara. Oh, Makara means my friend in Irish. Oh, decent. I've got an Irish friend. I'll have to call him Makara later and see if he understands what I'm on about. I think he speaks some Irish. I'm not sure. Where did those three goals come from, by the way? Like, what the fuck? Not that I'm complaining, but where did those... Yeah, you're not wrong, clever bot. 7-2, that scoreline rings a bell. Although it might be 7-3, and is. 3-2 on the night, 7-3 on aggregate. Uh, yes, pin dog. The donation sound is the um, the bit from where Spider-Man comes in, in the um, Captain America Civil War trailer. Now, Makara1 has just subscribed as well. Cheers, pal. It's very kind of you. Up to 134 subscribers. We dropped down to 30, 133 and now we're back up to 134. So we'll spam the sub hype for you in the chat. And some love hearts as well. Arigi with a cross. Into Chaka. Chaka to... Never mind. <laughs> Chaka to an Everton player. Yeah, Irish is a language. It's a very complicated language. Oh, Rondon nearly scored again. If you'd like a follow on Twitter, by the way, Makara, now that you're a subscriber, then let me know. Let me know your Twitter handle in the chat if you'd like a follow on Twitter, and I will follow you, as that is the uh, main... That's the main subscriber perk. There we go. Full time. I'm going to say passionately, congratulations lads, delighted for you all. We're in the Capital One Cup final. Which means at some point later on in the stream series, the suit will be back again. Oh, my eye got really itchy all of a sudden. <laughs> Uh, oh, XRP Cambridge, that sucks. We're through Liverpool Book Wembley Place. Fans jubilant after Everton result. Delighted. Very happy. Pleased. Uh, it was a brilliant strike, actually. Uh, I'm going to say I thought, yeah, I get on well with him. I don't know anything about him, but. <laughs> soup, 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 soup. Minilay wants to discuss. What? Oh yeah. Everyone wants to leave for European football now, and I keep I'm having to say every time. Um. Just stick with us till the end of the season, and we'll hopefully have European football for you. Hashtag Suitnoid. Uh, there you go. I will follow you now, Makara Gordon. Pink. Follow. Cheers, pal. For the subscription and the sizable donation. It's very kind of you. Uh, great. Good game for Monaco. He's having a good loan spell, in all, in all fairness. Great. Six goals and four assists in 23 games, although two of the goals have been penalties, but still. We've got Nottingham Forest in the Capital One Cup final. I'm going to have to tweet my mate Joe this. I've got one of my best friends from YouTube, Joe, Joe Bellin HD. He's a, a massive Forest fan. So I'm going to tweet him that. We had a couple of games rearranged. Now we've got Leeds in the FA Cup. Norwich signed Destro. 
Is Petite Destro any good in this game? Uh, not really. Oh, are you already in the stream? What? I don't see your name in the chat, Joe. Unless your um, subscriptions run out, in which oh no, there you go. I just, I just, <laughs> fuck's sake, I just seen it. <laughs> fuck's sake! I realise you're on your other account. <laughs> the deep inside. <laughs> oh, where's the monster downstairs, eh? What's your reaction to Carl Robinson marking out? Uh, he's entitled to his opinion. Good opportunity. Uh, no. Training's excellent. Not going to comment on that. Daniel Sturridge. Not very comfortable with that idea. Rule anything out. Done. Uh, we have signed two players today, Makari. Yes. Two? Three. Three. We signed three players in today's stream. I'll show you in a sec. When I've gotten rid of these emails, Napoli make Minule bid again. Piss off. Real Madrid make bid for Sacco. Piss off. Right, uh, transfers. It's what a season it's been for transfers, by the way. You can't quite see this, I don't think, because of the overlay. Look, hang on. I'm going to. Which one is? Which ones do we need to take off? Uh, that one. There you go. Look. We've spent this this season a hundred and seventy two million pounds on transfers. A hundred and seventy two million. That's incredible. We've made one hundred and thirty eight though, so our net spend is only thirty four million. Our net spend is only thirty four mil, which is madness. And to be fair, a large percentage of the Villems. And the Masaccio and the Lacazette deals are all monthly payments over time as well. So uh, it's not, we're not actually, we haven't actually spent 172. Financially, the club is all right. We've got 18 million in the bank. It did have, we did have 50, but obviously I just spent a lot of money on uh, a couple of players in today's stream. Right. Gaming at sleeves. We're playing mini lay again. Walker. Who who have we got at the weekend? Tottenham. Okay. Okay. Flanagan. I'm gonna start Dogi go Dogeen. Godin and Masakio. And Willems. Chaka and Henderson. How long is how when's Blaze Matweedy back? Three to four weeks. Okay, not long. Not long, not long. Jordan Ive on the right. Uh, Firmino at Cam. Origi on the left. And Ings again up top. Because I, I want my I want my normal first team players to be available for the game against Spurs. Because that's a big game. That Spurs game is huge. Uh, Yami, Pastore... Lacazette, and we'll put another defender on the bench in the form of Matip. Matip, Matip. Godin, Godin. Godin is number 13. Aha. Godin, Godin. I put Willems in there, didn't I? Yeah, I put Willems in there. Williams, Masaccio, Masaccio, Godin. Uh, assertively... That. At least the three new signings reacted in the... In the window. In the window. In the... Press... Uh, team talk. Come on, brain. Pay attention. We've got three new defenders in the back line for this one. But Godin and Masakio both speak Spanish. 
Oh, Danny. So hopefully they'll be able to play quite well alongside each other, having at least some sort of knowledge of each other. Oh, what a ball across. 1-0. What a ball across. That delivery from Jordan I was ridiculous. To so just pick out Origi there. Lovely ball. And a volleyed finish. Mad ting. Sick ting. How many of my players are learning English? About six, I think. And we've taught another three or four. Timo Horn, Pastore, Blaise Matuidi, they all speak English now. Oh, Chaka at the near post. He's in incredible form right now. Granite Chaka. Jordan Ibers. Oh no, he's twisted his ankle. No, Jordan. Let's put Yami on. Oh, Masakio off the bar. So close to a debut goal. So close to a debut goal. Here we go, there's another one. Three nil after twenty seven minutes. Sorry, Leeds. Didn't really stand a chance, did you, to be honest? Not the form we're in. Oh, it's going to drop to Origi for four. For four. Bentley makes a double save. Um, I reckon Liverpool can do it tomorrow against Dortmund. Whether they will or not is a different question. They definitely have the ability to do it. There's another one, Firmino. Firmino. Bom, bom, bom. Bom, 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 Firmino. I think Dortmund will struggle under the wrath of Anfield. Nah. 4-1, GG, they got a game, they got a goal back. Wolfski. Wolfski, not Wolfski. Uh, this is just the third round, Jack. No, fourth round. Fourth round. We beat Exit of 4-1 at the beginning of the stream in the third round, and now this is the fourth round. And the board want us to reach the quarterfinals. Well, I mean, I can't really say anything other than I'm happy, can I, really? Check the Steam page, Stan the Man, for um, 
minimum spec specifications for FM. If you check the Steam page, it'll tell you. Then you can obviously compare your machine to how well it specs up against the minimum specs. But pretty much, pretty much every machine can run Football Manager to some degree. Oh, mini legged save. I was going to make a change, but we'll leave it. Yeah, still waiting for that clean seat. We do concede a lot of goals. We concede less than we did, though, which is a good thing. We used to concede a lot more than we are we do now. Finish that, Danny. Never mind. Yami. Yami again. Oh, my God. Is Godin worth 43 million? In what season, Anthony? As in first year, like in real life, I'd say yes. I wouldn't have paid 43 million for him on in this third season, but considering he's 31 now. Williams has picked up a calf strain. Hopefully that won't keep him out for too long. comes the Leeds counter-attack. Oh, it's a lovely ball. Is he offside, though? Yeah, he's offside. <whistles> oh, that's great football. If that had ended in a goal, that would have been incredible. Uh, let's take Origi off the personal way, just for the last few. Second season, the scouts keep saying sign for whatever the price. What what team are you at, Anthony? You probably said earlier on, but I can't remember. Godin is very good though. I wouldn't say he's worth 43 million though. Good win, boys. Well done. We're through to the fifth round of the FA Cup. The draw is here. Philems is out for three, two to three weeks. That's all right. It's not too long. Jordan Ive is out for two to three weeks. Fine. Godin makes his debut, gets a 7.6. Take it one game at a time. Henderson gets a goal and an assist and an overall rating of 9. Oh, you're at PSG with 300... Oh, yeah, if you're at PSG, just pay it. <laughs> you've got no worries if you're at PSG. Just pay it. Don't matter. And Tottenham just beat Chelsea 4-1. Fucking hell. Argentina! Argentina! Gabriel Paulista from Arsenal. Paid seven million for him. That's mad, though. You got Arsenal relegated in your first season. GG. Takes quite the achievement. Come on, Cambridge. No! Oh, I Cambridge in the next round. Oh, well. Cambridge. Cambridge. Oh, they're in a real dodgy run of form. Never mind. Come on, Hughes. Come on, Hughes. Oh, 
Tottenham. Tottenham, Tottenham, Tottenham. We're going to the FA Cup draw first, I think. Right. Then Tottenham. Who are we going to get in FA Cup? I'd like a lower. I'd like like a Championship side, if possible. I mean, if possible, please. We're at home to Stoke. Okay, cool. We're at home to Stoke. Right, spuds. What have you got for me? Checo and Hendo. Kazet, Astore, Yami, Studge. Mino, Origi, Ings, and we'll put Misaki on the bench too. Where are you? Where are you? There you are, Mateo. Hello. Right, this is going to be a difficult game. Spurs away, third versus fifth. Let's go, boys. Nice football. Can Lacazette provide the delivery? Oh, we can, but no one's going to get on the end of it, sadly. No mistake here, Mamadou. Thank you. Oh, that's great football. Square at Yami. Oh, shot. Come on. Come on, the boys. Uh, we're playing at Wembley because uh, Spurs are having their ground redone, aren't they? That's why the game is at Wembley. Uh, yes, Georgie, this will be the last game. Oh, all right, Christian. Bloody hell. I know they never square it, but I always find myself telling them to. Oh, Pastore. Oh, that time he squared it. We scored! Yamalenko! Yeah! Pastore with a volley. Lloris with a great save. Walker back to Lacazette. Lloris with another great save, but it drops to Yamalenko and he buries it in the top corner. If I win this match by more than, more than three goals, you'll donate £35. Don't quite think that's going to happen, bro. Oh, man. This is the... Like, a game of tennis is back and forth from half to half. Royce. Oh, nobody could read the deflection. 1 1. No, no, I believe you, SMI. It's just I don't think it's I don't think it's gonna I don't think we're gonna win by three goals. Or more than three goals. Win it by more than three goals. We'd have to win by four. So we'd have to win five one now for you to donate. <laughs> Oh, 
don't think it's going to happen. Oh. What happened to you, Squid Goggle? Did you bottle promotion or something? Just seen what you wrote in the chat. Oh, great save. <laughs> Yay, no donation for you. <laughs> You were top, weren't you? Squid Goggle. Oh, 2-1 Spurs. Christian Eriksen again. Oh, man. Board meeting. Board goes, we would like to meet to discuss expanding the scouting network. I go, sure, let's finally do it. They go, can't afford it. Let's hope the next meeting goes better. <laughs> okay, lol. You won League 2? Go on, Christian. Yes, my man. Oh, Harry Kane. Liverpool are definitely going in the right direction with Klopp, yeah. He's a great manager. Eriksen's injured now. Why couldn't he have been injured 45 minutes ago so he didn't play? Then we'd be 1-0 up. Come on, lads. Turn it around. I don't know what the new Spurs ground's going to be called. Aren't they just expanding White Hart Lane? Or are they building a whole new ground? The Idiot Arena. <laughs> I don't know. Let's Google it, shall we? Tottenham New Stadium. Northum apparently right now it's called the Northumberland Development Project uh, I don't think there's any word on a name for it Come on, boys, let's get equaliser, shall we? Ugh. Ugh. Yami, you're not, you're not pulling your weight, fam. Arigi's coming on. Put Ings on for studs as well. Come on, boys, let's get a winner. Or oh, equaliser, sorry. Let alone a winner. No, yeah, I'll link, I'll put a link in the chat to the article on Tottenham's website about it. Oh, we squared it. Yeah, we scored. That's why you fucking square it, boys. We've equalised. That's why you don't shoot in situations like that. You square it and you score. Origi comes off the bench to grab us a goal. Not clicking that link, you'll get bird flu from it or something. Don't concede now. Don't. No, Marco. Thank you. Oh, that's the result. I didn't hear the whistle go. It just said one just started walking off the pitch. Uh, well done, lads. 
a draw keeps us fifth. We have a game in hand and can go fourth with it. Those draws against West Brom and uh, thingy have cost us, really. Mm, pardon me. The draw against Middlesbrough and West Brom, we could be, we could be four points better off. We could be on fifty points already. Wow. If we'd have beaten West Brom and Middlesbrough, we'd be we'd be joint second with a chance to go top with our game in hand. Those two draws against West Brom who are bottom and Middlesbrough who are fourteenth. Knocked us out of the Champions League spots. But it's um it's currently twenty five to eleven, so that's gonna draw us to a close for tonight. Thank you very much for watching though, guys. If you're watching on YouTube, make sure you drop the video a like rating. If you're watching on Twitch, make sure you follow the Twitch channel. Or if you're watching on YouTube too, make sure you follow the Twitch channel. Follow me on Twitter as well. Uh, thank you to Ruben for resubscribing, or Legendhood for resubscribing for 12 months in a row. Thank you to Makara1 for subscribing for the first time and for the big donation. Also to Steve for the big donation of £10 and Rob for the donation of a pound as well. All very much appreciated. Thank you to everybody else that has been here as well. We will save game and we will continue on tomorrow night so of course feel free to come back um i tell you what uh, toby's streaming right now toby's streaming the stick of truth the side park the side park the um the south park game go ahead and go and raid toby go and give toby a cheeky chesno gaming raid But that's all for me for tonight. Thank you very much. I just typed V's in the chat rather than copy and paste. Thank you very much for watching, guys. And uh, I will see you tomorrow.